the top 10 home and garden products to sell on your dropshipping stores home and garden is probably one of the best dropshipping categories with an exceptionally high sell-through rating that is because home and garden is an evergreen niche which means it is a niche which is selling all year long and not just a few months in a year that's why in this video i'm going to go over the top 10 home and garden products that you need to sell on your dropshipping stores to make more sales and more profit so watch this quick intro and let's begin Hello everyone, my name is Liran from AutoDS. I'm the content producer and I've also been dropshipping for the last four years. And like I said, in this video, we're going to go over the 10 best home and garden products to sell on your dropshipping stores. So let's go ahead and get right to it. But one second before we start, I just wanna remind you guys to like this video because it really helps out our channel. Share this video so that your friends and family can also learn about the wild and amazing world of dropshipping. And subscribe to our YouTube videos so that you can always stay updated on valuable and informational videos like this one to help you with your product research, suppliers, marketplaces, saving a whole lot of time and making a whole lot of profit. So let's get on to it with the 10 best products to sell on your dropshipping stores in the home and garden niche. So the first product that I want to talk to you guys about are memory foam pillows. Now this is not a new niche, it's been around for a while, but as we've seen, the sales are continuing to rise and that makes sense because people want to get comfortable inside their homes during the COVID-19. It's not a comfortable situation, so you might as well make the home as comfortable as you can. And what better way to get a good night's sleep? So let me show you some examples from some of the suppliers on memory foam pillows so here we have aliexpress they have a very nice variety of memory foam pillows they come in different variations sizes and colors and different forms so aliexpress has a bunch here is an example on amazon they also sell a whole bunch of memory foam pillows and it makes sense because it's a very very trendy product here we have home depot which is an excellent supplier for home and garden products so they also sell their share of memory foam pillows. Most of them are US suppliers, which ship really, really quick to the United States. Some can be Chinese suppliers. There's absolutely no problem with that. A lot of people are dropshipping from Chinese suppliers and from US suppliers. They both have their own advantages and disadvantages. My personal opinion, I personally love American suppliers, US suppliers, because they ship really quick to the US and the US is simply such a huge market. So that's memory foam pillows. They're super trendy. They're selling a lot. So add them to your stores. Moving on to product number two on the list for products that you need to add to your dropshipping stores. Now we're on a product called topiary trees. And these are really cool decor trees that you can add around the house. This can be either an indoor or an outdoor product. And of course, it's been a super trendy product. That is why I'm sharing it with you guys. Here is Home Depot. They have a very nice collection of topiary trees, as you can see here. They also come in different types of sizes, different types of forms. So you have a variation to add to your stores here. And by the way, you should add 20 product ideas for each product that I'm giving you guys. And that is simply because if you're only going to add, let's say one, two or three products from each product idea, it's not going to give you guys enough information to analyze your products and see exactly which product line is performing well when compared to those that are not performing well. If you guys want to have good data for analyzation and good product research, add at least 20 product ideas from each product niche that I'm giving you guys over here. So topiary trees, add 20 of them. So this is Home Depot. You have a few pages of these trees. Now let's check out Amazon. As you can see here, they also have their nice selection. And it is also a medium to high ticket product, which means you can make some extra profits selling these topiary trees. So Amazon has them, Home Depot has them. Let's check out Walmart. As you can see, they also have them. And these bald topiary trees have been extra trendy this year. So check those out. Add them to your stores along with the other shapes that you're seeing here in all of its shapes, forms, and sizes. Let's check out AliExpress. And as you can see here, AliExpress doesn't have the best topiary trees. And this is one reason why you definitely always need to work with more dropshipping supplier. The optimal number of dropshipping suppliers that you should be working with is three. If you're going to work with only one dropshipping supplier, you're going to get stuck in situations like this where you can't find the product that you're looking for. And that's too bad because other suppliers have them and you can make a lot of extra profit when you're working with more than one dropshipping supplier. 
that's one reason to have a wider range of products. You're also going to enrich your knowledge and learn more. And if one supplier ever fails you for any reason, like in the beginning of the year when COVID-19 struck and there were no Chinese suppliers and no Chinese warehouses working. So everyone that was working with only Chinese suppliers had no one to work with for over a month, which is a very bad thing for your business if you're putting all of your balls in one basket. So don't work with just one dropshipping supplier. The optimal number is three. Now let's move on. We're done with topiary trees. Product number three on the list of the best home and garden products to sell on your dropshipping stores is a product line called RGB floor lamps. This is a high ticket product. You're going to make some very nice profits from this product. And the best news is it wasn't selling all year long and it wasn't selling during the last year because this is a relatively new product, which is on a huge rise as we speak. So check out this trend and let me show you what our suppliers have to say when it comes to selling this new trendy product. Let's head over to Amazon. And here's the product that we're talking about. These are those RGB floor lamps. It's these really long and thin decor lamps that have a bunch of colors. So it looks really, really nice when you put it in the corner of the house. Let me show you guys like this example over here. So this is Amazon. They have their share. And like I said, it is a high ticket product. You're going to make some great profit selling this product. Like I said, it is a relatively new product, but it's high and trending. So now is definitely the perfect time to add these products. So this is Amazon. Let's check out Walmart. Walmart is also starting to get them now but as you can see they have different versions and it's not exactly the product that we're talking about so in this case since i only saw about one variation of what we're looking for which is this one or this one it's not going to be enough we're looking for more so amazon was a good example in this case now let's go to aliexpress aliexpress also has a very nice selection they are cheaper than amazon and it makes sense because these products are coming from china even though we're talking about the same product aliexpress has a very very nice variation of these rgb floor lamps just as amazon does now let's check out home depot and as we can see home depot still didn't get with the trend so in this case our two winners are aliexpress and amazon two out of four suppliers were handy in this case and that is exactly why you guys need to work with more than one supplier i hope i made that point clear so rgb floor lamps are the third product that you need to add to your stores for home and garden now let's move on to product number four on the list and on number four, we have a product called glass terrariums. This is a glass decor product, which mainly holds and displays plants in a very nice and elegant way. So when you're done watching this video, go ahead and read the blog below. So when you're done watching this video, go ahead and read the full blog below. You'll have everything that I'm talking about, and it'll be easier for you to take these product ideas by just copying them and pasting them within your suppliers to get these product ideas and add more products which are similar to the ones that I'm recommending you guys to add to your stores. This way you'll be able to find your own trends. So these are glass terrariums. Right now we're looking at Home Depot and it makes sense because they sell mostly home and garden products. Let's just scroll down to see how much they have. So we only have 51 results. That's okay. We can add about five to 10 products from Home Depot, but definitely check out your other suppliers. Amazon, it's not surprising at all. They have a very nice selection of very elegant looking glass terrariums. So definitely check that out. And I would add these bundle packs that come in six packs and in three packs like you can see here because it's very hard to find these products in stores. The buyers who will look at these products will most likely not have them across the street. For one reason, physical storefronts are still on lockdown. But even if they were open, these type of products are really hard to find in stores, which make them perfect for drop shipping. So as you can see, Amazon has a whole bunch. And I'm sure that they'll have more than three pages. They got seven pages of glass terrariums. Let's check out Walmart. Walmart also has a selection. This product looks just like Amazon's one that I recommended a second ago. So let's see who's selling it cheaper. Here it is. Amazon is selling it for $12.99 and Walmart is selling it for $14.39. So obviously you'd know who you'd want to buy from. But each supplier is going to have their own variations. So definitely check them all out. And Walmart has 24 pages of this product. So there you have it. Walmart has more than Amazon. This way you'll have a much higher reach into this product range. Now let's check out AliExpress really quick. I wouldn't have any doubts, but as you can see here, they also have a very nice range of glass terrariums. So you can also add from them 60 pages full of this product. So add at least 20 of this product onto your stores so that you can analyze it and profit from those sales. So glass terrariums are the fourth product that I want you guys to add to your stores when it comes to the home and garden niche. Now let's move on to product number five. And on number five on the list, we have garden statue figurines. 
let me show you so here we are at home depot with these garden statue figurines you obviously know exactly what this product is it's just these little statues that people put in their gardens to make it look and feel more alive everyone has a certain character that they connect to so you have a whole bunch of different types of figurines so here is home depot Let's check out Amazon. As you can see, also a very nice selection. There's almost no doubt about it that any product that you're looking for, you'll definitely find a good range in Amazon. Now let's check out Walmart. Garden statue figurines. Walmart also has a nice selection. And these add such a special touch to the garden. It is an evergreen niche. Even in the winter, these garden statue figurines are selling well. And this brings us to product number six for the best home and garden products that are trending right now. And product number six are hanging planters. It is another decor product which matches also for indoor and for outdoor. Let's check it out with some of our suppliers, starting with Home Depot. And yeah, they definitely have their hanging planters. I can see that they do have a nice selection and about 190 results. So you can definitely find some here, but never stick to only one supplier like I mentioned before. Now let's check out Amazon. A nicer collection if you ask me, more colorful, a bigger variety. Check out this one that comes in bundle packs. And I always recommend to go with bundle packs once again because you simply can't find this specific bundle in stores. That's why it's going to make it much easier to sell such products. So Amazon has a nice collection. Let's check out Walmart. They also have their selection of hanging planters. Here you can see that it's used as an indoor product. You're also going to see it as an outdoor product, as I've mentioned. Here it is on the outdoor next to a tree. So hanging planters definitely need to be on your list for home and garden products that are trending right now. So that's product line number six on the list of products that you need to add for home and garden. And this brings us to product number seven. And on number seven on the list, we have Crescent Moon Shelves. This is another really cool indoor decor product that has been super trendy in the last few months. And there are more product lines coming out with different shapes, colors, and sizes for this crescent moon shelf. Here's Amazon's results. It is a very good looking decor product. And as you've noticed, we are not recommending general categories because general categories need to be micro niche down to see exactly which products inside the general categories are selling. For example, these crescent moon shelves their general category shelves that people simply stick on the walls and put stuff on them but if i just told you guys to sell shelves it would not be smart there's tens of thousands of shelves you wouldn't know exactly which one is going to sell and when you micro niche it you'll find these crescent moon shelves which are super trendy right now which means that now obviously is the best time to sell them and if you want to catch this new trend now is the time because not too many people are selling them yet. And now let's move on to product number eight for the best products that you need to sell on your dropshipping stores for the home and garden niche. And on product number eight, we have mirror wall stickers. We've seen the rise in sales for this category because people are decorating their homes during the COVID-19. They're spending most of their time at homes. Therefore, these categories are booming right now. Now let me show you with some of our suppliers how well this product is selling and the whole bunch of variations that it has. Let's head over to Amazon. Amazon has their share of wall stickers. Once again, it's not surprising. So you can find the whole bunch here. Some of these wall stickers are writings. Some of them are designs and shapes. And some of them can even replace wall tiles, which can completely decorate your whole wall. So here are some of the results that we have on Amazon. Let's check out AliExpress. So here we are, a whole bunch of wall stickers. They all look good. They all look nice. They're all selling really well. Let's see Walmart and their results. They also have a whole bunch of wall stickers. You can obviously find them also over here, about 25 pages full, so no problem to find them at Walmart. Home Depot also has wall stickers, which look different than what we've seen on Walmart and AliExpress and Amazon. So they are another good choice for this niche. They even have stickers which look like real wood, like this one and this one. The other suppliers also have them, but you definitely should check Home Depot on this niche because they do have a nice selection, which you won't be able to find through other suppliers. So wall stickers is product number eight on the list of products that you need to add to your stores for the home and garden niche. And this brings us to product number nine on the list, gardening toolkits. And it's very easy for dropshippers to sell because it comes in bundles and packs, which you can compare one-on-one -on -one with what you're seeing in stores because each bundle pack comes with its own tool which also makes it difficult for the end customer to pinpoint the exact price 
that this product should cost. Let me show you guys with some of the suppliers exactly what I mean. Heading over to Amazon, and it's probably not surprising, but they definitely have a very nice share of gardening tools. Now, the example that I wanted to show you guys is when you're seeing a product like this, if you have a hardware store across the street, they most likely won't have a bundle pack that looks like this. And this is what makes this category very, very special for dropshippers. You should always be looking for categories that are hard to find in stores. And this is one of those perfect examples. So this is Amazon. This is AliExpress. It's also no surprise, but they have a whole bunch of home and gardening tools, as you can see over here. So AliExpress, you also have Walmart, which sell their share of gardening tools. And on product number 10 on the list, I'm bringing you guys to a niche called flameless tea lights. Once again, micro niching from that general niche, which are candles or small lights. We're gonna put those together and micro niche it to a cool trendy product called flameless tea lights. This is a decor product. It's a mix of candles and LED lights. When you put them together, you get this cool decor product. So let's check out Amazon. So a nice selection of this product. It comes in bundle packs. You're usually not going to buy one or two. It should start with a minimum of five candles and it can climb up to 20s and 30s and 40s and 50s and even up to 100 and more. So as you can see, very nice selection. My recommendation is to add a quantity of two to three for each product that I'm recommending you to add to your stores. And that is because products like this one, customers usually buy more than one, even if it's a pack of 30 maybe they want 60 maybe they want 90 when you add a quantity of two to three for each product that you're adding to your stores not just these candles but every product that i was recommending in this video you will notice that people will buy more than one not each and every one of them but the buyers who do buy two or three will definitely make the difference when it comes to your sales and your profits. So here is AliExpress. They also have a very nice selection of these flameless tea lights. There's absolutely no problem to find them over here. So flameless tea lights is another product that you need to add to your stores for the home and garden niche because it's been catching a trend recently and there's no reason for you to miss that. So those are the 10 product ideas that we have for you guys for the home and garden niche. Once again, add 20 products from each product idea. Work with more than one supplier. My recommendation is three suppliers because if you're gonna work with four or five or more, it can get too confusing and you're not going to use the full potential of each one. Three suppliers is more than enough. Three suppliers is more than enough. And now I wanna talk to you guys about one last thing before wrapping up this video because it's going to save you guys a whole bunch of time when you're adding these products to your store. So here's the thing. I want to add 20 products of each product idea that I gave you guys. But adding 20 products from each product line is going to take a whole bunch of time. It could take me a few hours or a whole day or even more, depending on how many products I want to add to my stores. I want to save this time and add multiple products to my store, whether tens or hundreds or thousands, without having to enter each product listing one by one. So how would I go about this? The first thing that you need to do is download an extension called the AutoDS Dropshipping Helper. Once you add this extension to your Chrome browser, simply enter one of your supplier's product pages and you'll notice the AutoDS circle on the bottom. Click on that AutoDS circle and once again, while you're on that product page with all of the products that you want to add to your store, click on that extract button. Now, as you see, it moved 50 products from this page into this little helper extension down here. The next thing that you have to do is click on export as CSV. And as you see, it downloaded the file onto my computer. And now I'm going to head over to the AutoDS platform. This is the new layout. So for all of you eBay dropshippers, you're not seeing this layout yet, but you will be seeing it soon. What you're gonna do is click on add products, upload CSV, and here you can drag and drop your CSV file. So simply click on that window. Go to your downloads folder to wherever you downloaded that file. Simply double click on it. Here we go, processing CSV and file is uploaded. So now all of those 50 products are going to be added to one of our stores. Up here you can choose which stores you want to publish it to. So you can choose one store, two store, three stores, all of them, one of them, whatever you want. Down here, choose the supplier that you're adding the products from. So as you can see, there's more than 10 suppliers to work with, and we're always working on adding more, but this is how easy it is to add products from those suppliers. So in this case, we added the products from Amazon. The region is the United States. In the advanced options, you have more options for the product adding process, but I'm not gonna go through it one by one. That's not the point of this video. So once you click on next, you need to start configuring your options for this upload process. If you uncheck to use the supplier's default settings, you can choose whatever template you want. 
But what I do want to talk about is product tagging. So when you're adding new products to your stores, make sure that you're giving them some kind of tag. In this case, since we're adding home and garden products, let's create a new tag by writing home and garden and click on that plus. You can also add another tag, which is smart in this case. I would add home and garden because that's the niche that we're going for. But those 50 products that I'm adding right now to my stores are those flameless tea candles, right? So we're going to call this tag flameless tea candles. And now I just added two tags. One is a general home and garden niche tag and the other are flameless tea candles. Now this is going to allow me to analyze these products performance in the future. So one or two months from now, when I want to analyze the performance of the products that I'm adding right now, I can either open up all of the tags that I have in my home and garden niche to see exactly how all of my home and garden products performed. And I can check specifically the flameless tea candles, how they performed inside the home and garden niche. So you can check whole niche categories with product tags and specific micro niching how each product inside that category went. So definitely tag your products when you're adding products to your stores. You can obviously tag products that are in your stores which haven't been tagged yet, but do tag products when you're adding new products to your stores. Do not miss out on this because it's all about data and this is exactly what tags gives you. So once again, I'm not going to go through all of the options. If you need help on adding products to your stores, you have a tutorial for each and every section that we have on our knowledge database on our website and we also have a live chat support to help you guys at any time of the day simply log on to the AutoDS platform and use that chat option on the bottom right to get in touch with one of our assistants so once you're done with the general settings click on next you'll head on to the pricing settings the shipping and policies and then you'll get to the option where you can import the products to your store or to the drafts page where you can optimize them more before adding them to your stores and having AutoDS monitor them. And that's how simple it is to add tens to hundreds to even thousands of products to your store in just a few clicks. Once you import them to your store, all of the products that we had in that CSV file will be added to your stores. So that's how simple it is to add all of those products to your stores. And that sums up this video for you guys for the 10 best home and garden products to add to your dropshipping stores. I hope that you found this video super informational. And if you did, give us a like. Subscribe if you haven't done so to learn more about the wild and amazing world of dropshipping. And share this video so that your friends and family will also have the opportunity to learn about this wonderful and amazing world of dropshipping. So start implementing these product ideas on your stores right now. Happy profiting and I'll see you guys in the next video.